This is Oppo A3 and today I'll show how you can perform an initial system setup procedure on this device. So in the beginning you will need to press this button and now select the language that you would like to use as your default choice for the system. Next select your region. Then uh, get acquainted with user agreement and user privacy protection, then hit next. Now you can optionally insert a SIM card and, can and connect your device to a mobile network or you can skip the step for now. Then you can also set up using another device, an older phone of yours perhaps, or you can skip the step and set this device up as a new and fresh smartphone. Here you can also optionally connect to a Wi-Fi network or you can skip this step and continue the setup offline. So in this particular case it does not allow us to perform an offline setup but that's fine. I'll just quickly connect myself to Wi-Fi and we should be good to go. Yep. Now wait for a little bit. On this uh, step or during this step you can copy your apps and data from a previous device or you can do not, uh, avoid copying and once again set this device up as a fresh new phone. Here you can sign into your Google account or skip this step and do that later. Now enable what Google services you would like to use and disable the ones you do not want to. Then hit the accept button. Next step is to select the preferred or default browser app and search engine. So do that, make that selection. Here you can once again also optionally set up a screen unlock or screen lock method so you can lock your screen with a pin code, pattern, password, fingerprint and or face unlock. I will skip this step for now but you can do that either currently or at any given point in the future. Now you can also uh, try the features below for a better user experience and just enable what features you would like to use and what not around with those options then select what screen display size you would like to have large medium or default select the preferred system navigation method buttons digital buttons or gestures you can also learn the gestures if you are new to them and I guess the setup is finished your Oppo A3 is all configured and ready to be used and well as far as this video goes that'll be it. so thanks for watching and bye bye